with eight points Muay Thai and fitness and uh, today I'm here with one of our fighters here Jeff and we're gonna be talking about the pendulum kick pendulum kick um, and this is a, a very uh, well used move in Muay Thai uh, very traditional Thai style move uh, the pendulum kick is used when you need to cover distance or when we're attacking that back leg um, you, I don't know if you guys ever seen uh, uh, those that's why it's called pendulum because you see those balls and the pendulum on the guys the rich guys desk and it goes back and forth, back and forth. That's exactly what we're doing with our feet. Now I've seen this kick done a few different ways and sometimes people um, swing that leg out which takes your power away. What we're gonna talk about today is going straight forward with that pendulum. So I'm gonna use Jeff, he's gonna be in a fighting stance. First thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna, let's say that I'm not in my distance. As you've seen in the shadow boxing video and the boxing videos and the bag work video, we uh, have a measuring stick in Muay Thai, our style of Muay Thai, which is this jab. If I can hit him with the jab, mm, I can do everything else. So let's just say for whatever reason, I'm out of my range. I'm out of my range, but I still want to attack him, okay? Pendulum kick is a great kick to do. So I'm here outside this boxing range, outside this Muay Thai range. So I'm gonna still throw this jab so he can see something. After I throw this jab, this foot is going to almost knock this foot out of the way. Boom. Boom. A lot of times people try to switch this. You can't switch this on a pendulum kick. You have to replace the kick. It has to replace the foot. So I'm going to come here, just throw this, just throw this. This is going to replace the foot, and I go straight forward. I see some guys try to go way out here. That's no good. I, I, I waste all this energy. I've got to go straight forward. Hitting this leg. Mm. 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 So I'm throwing, throwing, pendulum kick, and then I'm right back to a safe distance. Another way we can use the pendulum kick is to attack this back leg. If you watch in Muay Thai fights, a lot of times they really target this back leg, a good leg kicker does. Most of the time in training, a person's gonna stand one way. So this front leg is always gonna take more abuse. You're gonna get tougher. Even if you don't check, you're still gonna get tougher getting kicked in that leg. This back leg, it's very tough unless you're, you, you can do fight both ways. It's very tough because you don't think about strengthening this back leg. So this can be a weapon that we can utilize in the fight to really take somebody out. So we're going to be in our jab distance this time. This time I'm in my jab distance. I can attack him. So what I'm going to do is hit that jab and use that pendulum kick to attack the back leg. So I'm hitting, hitting, hitting that foot, knocking it out of the way. Mm attacking that back leg. One more time. Ooh. You always have to come back to a stance you can fight from, guys. I don't want to hit this pendulum kick and then land right here where he can clinch me or elbow me or whatever. I want to attack him and then get right back to a stance I can fight from. So I'm hitting, Ooh. hitting, pendulum kick. Ooh. We're going to go to the other side to give you a different look. The first one, we're here, here, hitting this leg out of the way. Ooh. And then we're in our range. We're in our range. Attacking that back. For more information on Muay Thai, you can check out 8PointsMuayThai.com or the MuayThaiGuy.com.